What's up, Bobolines? Welcome to Party Games. In the last episode, the last episode, we will talk about Quillfish, baby. Talk about you and me. Talk about all the Quill things and the... I don't know what the fuck... I'm, I don't know where I'm going with that shit. Anyway, we're talking about Quillfish and being like, Hmm, when does it evolve? There's a good reason I uh, didn't really know when it evolved or even what it evolved to for that matter. Because it's a fucking useless piece of garbage and doesn't evolve. It apparently doesn't evolve, like, at all. So, a, a pointless friggin' Pokemon, but I suppose that's the way it is sometimes. It's gonna be sitting in my PC for a while. Um, we're at Cerulean City for a particularly, I suppose, interesting reason. I think it's gonna be quite interesting. We're gonna go catch ourselves a Suicune and whatever Suicune is gonna be. Uh, I have no idea what level it's gonna be, actually, so... Because I told you, I didn't do this when I played Heart Gold, when I actually played Heart Gold. So, I don't know what level this is going to be. It could be too high for our, our team. Um, but we're going to see, anyway. Uh, but yeah, so Quillfish. I, I believe, I did Google it. I believe it's up here. But anyway, Quillfish, right. I had this sort of feeling with Pokemon like Quillfish, like Farfetch'd. Farfetch'd? Farfetch'd. Uh, these Pokemon that, you know, aren't useful. Uh, was it a Love Disc? Another one? Just kind of random Pokemon that don't have an evolution. No one would ever use because they're pointless. I kind of feel like, uh, there must be like a team of 10 people sitting around making these Pokemon for the Pokemon games. And there's one dude called like Gary. He's probably not called Gary. He's, he's probably called like Ichi or some shit because they're, they're, they're Japanese, right? But anyway, so Ichi's sitting there and the other nine people creating Pokemon, they don't really like Ichi. So every time he goes, hey, I've got a great idea for a Pokemon. I'm gonna make a balloon Pokemon that has poison points. They go, oh, yeah, yeah, Itchy, no worries. We'll do that for you. We're not giving it evolution, though. No, and we're giving it crap stats, because why would we Why would we do anything for you? There he is. There's our Suicune. But anyway, that's, that's kind of what I feel like it must be. There's just the one dude of the Pokemon makers that they're just like, no, we don't like you, so we're going to give you all this shit Pokemon. Um, anyway, so Usain's not here, so it looks like I beat him. Uh, but Suicune! Hey, buddy! How you doing, big dog? I've already got one, so I don't really... Puff Puff, oh, I have no match for you, suck it, Suicune, as I predicted. Go ahead. Since I met you in the Burnt Tower at Ecritique City, I've sort of known that Suicune would choose you. Yeah, no shit, bro. Take a look at it! Suicune is waiting for you! It has been waiting for a battle with a worthy trainer to whom it can entrust itself. Alright, bro. Alright, so, uh, wish me luck, people. This is... Hopefully this will be something good, because this will probably be a decent level, obviously. But also it has to be catchable, so... We have a Master Ball, though. That is the good point. We have two Master Balls. So what are you going to be, Suicune? What are you... Miltank. Level 40. Ugh. That's... That's rough. We already have a Miltank, so... Okay, so that was a big waste of goddamn time. Uh, I don't reckon a Surf from Sperm... Ooh, we have Choice Specs, though. This might kill it. This probably won't kill it. They're pretty bulky old Miltanks. Doesn't matter, I've already got a mill tank. Okay, that was perfect. That did everything I needed it to do, so. We'll catch, okay, paralyze me. That's actually good, synchronize. There we go. So, anyway, we'll speed this up, because it's just a mill tank, and we've already had one of these bloody things. So, we will, we will catch it though. Here you go, mill tank. Come on, it had to be a dupe's claw, didn't it? Had to be a dupe, but I mean, it's only level 40 as well. So it's not like it's even a shitload better on that, in that respect either. So anyway. That's our Suicune encounter. We called it wonderful, kind of a waste of time. Give a nickname to Miltank. Yeah, uh, okay, we're just gonna, like we have been doing lately, we're just gonna name it real quick and we'll, we'll call it Suicune, why the hell not? It seems like it's a reasonable name for it. A pretty disappointing bloody Suicune encounter, that's for sure, but we'll, we'll live. We've already got a normal Pokemon as well. Like, I'll consider using it if we didn't already have Porygon, but we don't need two normal types. You two are truly amazing. I've never seen a battle this intense. I have no regrets. Was it? Was it that intense? I used one move and then caught it first Pokeball. Farewell, Suicune. Farewell, Monots. Hey, hey, Su hey, you sing. Come back. Oh my god, I just realized. You sing. No, anyway. I was like, you seen is like Suicune backwards, but it's not. It has a lot of the letters in Suicune, but it's not actually the same. But yeah, sorry, you seen. You can. You can have the mill tank if you want to, and I don't really need it. Um, I don't know why I'm running this way. I don't know why I'm doing that. I'm gonna fly. I'm gonna straight up fly to, uh, where are we? A pewter? That's not pewter. Pewter. Viridian City. 
Sorry, Viridian. This is... What am I talking about? I'm trying to go to Pallet Town. I'm going to Viridian City. Because we're going to go to Route 1. We're going to go to Pallet Town. And then we're going to go down to... Uh, what are we talking about here? We're going to go to Cinnabar. Okay. I, I didn't... Sorry. I didn't mean to actually go to the computer. But I kind of actually will. I'm going to hedge a bet here, right? I don't think I'm going to need a fly when I'm on the way to Cinnabar. So I'm actually going to swap in I'm Dead, the Ursa Ring. I'm going to swap him in... In my party, just in case I need to teach something cut and strength. Because I have taken cut from Suicune. I do not want Suicune to know cut. So, I've taken that off him. So, Ursa Ring's gonna be there in case I need those HMs. I may not bother teaching him to him because I might not need them. But that is just that. I don't think I'm gonna need Fly. And if I do need Fly, it'll be a pain in the ass for me. But I can just cut that out for you guys so you don't have to see it. So, that's all good. Um... But yes, we'll definitely... We get an encounter at Route 1 here. So this is our last Route encounter, I believe. The rest of it's going to be like water routes and shit. Uh, I will just check to see if there's any fish... An area we can fish here. I doubt there will be. But if if there is one, that'll be most preferable. But we gotta, we'll have a few fights here. I'll probably leave most of them. Because I can't really be bothered doing all these fights. I don't think they're going to be super high level. Mr. Evers, what's with the ghost trainers around here? I know, I just... I just edited the last episode, and I remember there was there was a trainer that had only Mischievous's Shadow Ball. Okay, that might do a bit of damage. Remember the last one's using Payback, and it wasn't doing that much damage. So that'll actually do a bit of damage. Uh, I think we two shot these things, so we're not going to die to a Shadow Ball. That's cool. So another level of Suicune. That, <laughs> there are other Ghost Pokemon. Do you not know that there are other Ghost Pokemon? What? Are, I don't get why these these trainers are literally only having Suicunes. Okay, we're good. So we'll need to heal a Ghastly. There we go. All right, I'm actually going to heal up here uh, because um, I'm just going to heal and see if this thing Destiny Bonds. No, it's going to Dark Pulse. We should be faster than it. Yeah, so we'll be faster than it. I don't actually know when these Pokemon learn Dark Pulse. It's a worry for me. I don't want to lose anything to them. I don't want to lose... Sorry, Dark Pulse. Destiny Bond. I don't want to lose anything to a Destiny Bond. That would actually make my day suck. So many balls. Uh, again, there's, this is all grass and no water, which is a massive shame because I don't want to fight in the grass. I want some water, but I don't think that's. I don't think we're gonna have any choice here. I think it's all gonna be, all gonna be grass for us on Route One. We're gonna get ourselves a level four bloody Pokemon. Okay, so we will swap out. I probably should have healed Suicune here, but we'll, we'll swap out the Fuckfish. We should be alright. We should be alright. Level forty-seven Gyarados, like. Okay, Dragon Dance is a little bit scary, but once again, it's not going to one-shot us, and our special attack is up, so this should be a one-shot. Rain Dance, okay. So if this thing actually didn't die, it would do a shitload of damage to us, but it's going to die. Well, I believe it's going to die, yeah. Um, Fuckfish is just that... That special defense, when he gets that boosted, is special defense. Special attack, when he gets that boosted, is just kind of asinine. Uh, that's actually great that it had a, um, it used a rain dance for us because now Suicune is going to absolutely roll this Noctowl. It might not be a one shot. It's probably not going to be a one shot, but because Suicune's actually, we might have to heal after an air slash. Um, no, we're fine. But Suicune has better, like, better attack, uh, better defense stats than it does attack stats. Uh, so we're not going to do a shitload of damage with it, but it's... Right now, it's kind of like going to be similar to Mew in its stats. They're going to be very, they're going to be very close together, kind of useful. And um, I don't know why I'm in balls. That was really dumb. I do like balls, but uh, not for what I'm trying to do now, which is heal, heal my poor Suicune. Poor Suicune is actually pretty, pr uh, not poor at all. Pretty, pretty happy to be it. Um, Okay, so we're just going to run through the grass and get an encounter. It doesn't look like there's any water, so we're going to have to catch whatever this is. Uh, Charmander. Okay, so we we get another encounter. You know what? Uh, I was going to say, we could get another Typhlosion. We would have to level it from level two. I kind of like, I wouldn't mind. Yeah, so we get an encounter there in the water. I wouldn't mind another Typhlosion, let's be uh, honest. But we'll see what we get. If it's something diff... Oh, hey! Well... I am now currently incredibly happy 
that I didn't go for the Charmander. Now, this is going to be hard to catch uh, without wounding it, but we'll see how we go. I don't think it has any moves that, like, paralyze or anything, so we can't send Spermite out to synchronize or anything. Okay? Okay? One Ultra Ball? And we got ourselves a Tyranitar? This is ridiculous. My team is going to be fucking so good now when I get this thing up. I'm going to give it an EX. I'm going to put the XP share on. Like, there, there is no way I am not using this. This thing is dope. And Rock and Dark, we don't have either of those types. So, this is this is absolutely goddamn brilliant. I have no idea what I'm going to call it, though. All right, I'm going to call him EXP Grind. Because literally, that's going to be my life for the next five episodes. Trying to get that bloody thing to... Uh... Increase its level. And of course, of course, Pallet Town doesn't have a bloody Poke Center. Oh, no, no, there's a computer. Surely there's a computer in one of these houses. Is this like Red's mum? Red's been away. He hasn't called either, so I have no idea where he is or what he's been doing. They say no news is good news, but I do worry about him. He's become like a weird hermit on friggin' Mount whatever the fuck. Is that a computer that I can use? No. There's a computer in his room at the start of bloody red and blue and yellow and stuff and fire red and leaf green. Don't tell me there's not. Don't give me that shit. Maybe there's one in Oak's lab. I want to get this Tyranitar out. Hi, my kid brother is the gym leader in Viridian City, but he goes out of town so often it causes problems for the trainers. Well, send it, tell him to get back. It's causing me problems, bro Seth. All right, let's talk to Oak. Oakenstein. Ah, mum nuts. It's good of you to come all this way to Kanto. What do you think of the trainers out here? Pretty tough, huh? Ah, you're collecting Kanto gym badges. I imagine that it's hard, but the experience will surely help you. Come see me when you get them all. I'll have a gift for you. Keep it up, mum nuts. So how's your Pokedex coming along? Uh, have Johto assure this is gonna be simple. You've seen 246 Pokemon, and you've caught 100 Pokemon. I said, oh, I got to 100, the magic 100. I don't think I've caught 100 Pokemon. I don't think that's actually accurate. Oh, evolutions and stuff, yeah. You seem to be good at collecting things. Okay, show me... Okay, so it doesn't give me anything for that. He just, like, goes, yeah, good job. Hi, Prof oh, my God. If there's emails about me? God, fuck you. Get out of my life, Elm. Uh, okay, so we can't get this Tyranitar yet. So, I'm gonna have to cut back. So, if what I said was gonna happen, it's gonna freaking happen. Uh, what do you say? Technology is incredible. Okay. I will cut because I want to get this Tyranitar. There's a good chance I'll have to fight a trainer on the way back. Uh, actually, I'll, I'll see what else. I won't cut because I'll see what else we could have got in this grass. I mean, Tyranitar is dope. Uh, but we'll... I mean, uh, it's nice to, nice to check every now and again what's in here. I'm sure there will be trainers that I have to fight along the way, though, because that seems to be the way. Although, Aerodactyl. Okay. This grass is pretty solid. I think I prefer the... Uh, Okay, okay, sup Suicune, nice to see you again. Funny how in the episode that we catch the Suicune that wasn't a Suicune, we actually encounter a Suicune, but we didn't get to catch it. We wouldn't have caught it, obviously, because we already guts one, but okay, so that's great. We've come back and wasted your time because I didn't cut. Um, hey, I sp uh, look, I did do stuff while I was on the road. Anyway, so move you. All right, so... Just because we do need cut, potentially, I am going to take out, uh, Hornstar. Potentially risky, but I don't think there'll be any strong trainers on the way here. So we can take out Hornstar, I believe. We should be good. And then we can- No, I want to go to bag. I do want to go to bag. And we will just chuck on an EXP share on Tyranitar, who hopefully will level up reasonably quickly. I'm not super optimistic that we'll get it to a usable level anytime in the next 3,000 years, but it'll come along. Actually, I'm just going to heal real quick as well. It will come along at some point and uh, be usable. When is going to be the difficult question, but our team is coming along fucking nicely now. I'm just going to cut back down to Pallet Town though. All right, so... Another fishing experience for everyone here as well. So, uh, let's just... Where is it? Super Rod. Let's go. Let's try to use this thing adequately and not fuck it up. I know the last few episodes I was just terrible at catching Pokemon. Alright, what do we got? What do we got? Level 40. 
Hopefully this will be something good at level 40. Weeping Bell, we have had you. So we are going to straight up run from you and we'll go again. Come on, something good, baby. Something good. I mean, I probably can't be like, something good, something good, because I just got a Tyranitar. So, okie dokie. Apparently we are getting something good. Um, what is it? Grass. What can we use on this just to weaken it a little bit? Ouchie might do too much damage. Um, Suicune, I don't... I could hurt it with a Surf from Suicune, but I don't really want to. It'll be potentially dangerous to do that because it will... Obviously, it's Grass type, but it'll give us a little bit of an issue. Uh, ouchie. No, what have you got? What moves have you got? I don't think I can get away with the moves here. Revenge, attack, order, sword, dance, brick break. No, we'll kill it. I reckon actually will kill it. We might just have to throw Pokeballs. I'll, I'll try that first. We've been pretty lucky with Pokeballs lately, seeing as we caught a Tyranitar first time. So maybe we'll uh, we'll do this. But this could actually be really useful. i got to think... Okay, that's not good. Do I need grass is the question. But no, that's not what I do. I wanted to press that. Do I need grass? Um, okay, jumped out. I probably... Okay, I don't know why I was like, oh, it's going to be dangerous to have Suicune out here. And then I just let it, like, sit here for, for the, the for the bloody Meganium. So we're going to use a Surf, seeing as I left it out for ages. And we're going to try and see if we can do a little bit of damage this way. Okay, not very much. This thing doesn't seem to have any grass moves, so... Well, it's going to have grass moves, but... Okay, it's not really doing anything to us. Okay, one more surf, and then we'll swap out. Okay, cool. So, okay, I don't know what this Meganium's trying to do. It must have garbage bloody moves. But we'll send in Spermite. And, okay, now we should be able to catch this thing. Um, well, I would, this thing would be good if we could give it Frenzy Plant. I'm just saying, do we need grass? Because we don't need grass for water. We don't need grass for rock. We don't need grass for ground. We have a water-type Pokemon. Um, I suppose grass for water would be better than our... Discharge on a Porygon, but still, it's pretty it's pretty sufficient. Um, what do I want to call this thing? All right, so Flower Power. I will have you notice that it's actually the wrong flower as well, but the other one doesn't really fit. Um, and also, I will also say that uh, I put Power in, P-O-W-A-H, because I, I was, for a second there, I thought that Power, the actual word, wouldn't fit, and then realized again that Power with a W-A-H is the same length as power with a W-E-R. So just a whole bunch of bullshit, really. I, I don't know what's wrong with me. S several things, but there we go. Flower power. Look, a solid sixth member if we need it. Professor Oak, okay. He's just going to talk shit, isn't he? Professor Oak, your Pokedex is really filling up. Great, thank you. I appreciate it. Um, so let's see what else we could have got. We'll get, have a look at one more Pokemon because one of them was something we've already caught. I couldn't remember exactly what it was. A Weeping Bell. Um, cool. Landed a Pokemon. Uh, what is this gonna be? Flaffy! Okay, that would've been interesting. Another, obviously would've evolved, so we'll, we'll, I know, I do remember getting super hyped up about a Flaffy when it was like, well, actually, we, we can't get it, but, uh, did we change routes? Okay, I don't know if we changed routes just then. Yes, we changed routes, but it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a duplication, so we don't need to use it. I'm pretty sure we changed routes. I should put a I should put a repel on though, because I don't want to just accidentally catch something all friggin' willy nilly right now. All the willy nillies, that'd be annoying. I didn't really pay attention. It's probably lucky that we got a duplication. Although it was a level 30, so it wasn't too bad. Pallet Town, Route 21. Okay. I don't know why I got off that. I can still use that, but I'm gonna I'm gonna fish. Cause level 40 again, much better. But at least if if we get all duplications here. We can, um, we can catch something else in the grass or in the water as a surf. So, we've got plenty of options here, which is good. But what are we going to get now? Ariatus, okay. So, definitely, Meganium is the clubhouse leader to be that number six Pokemon. Because we've got four at the moment, and Tyranitar will take a spot. Um, but, I think, uh, yeah, I think definitely... Okay, so we should be able to catch this now. I think definitely Meganium, like, is a pretty strong choice for a, for a sick Pokemon. Like, again, like I said, we don't super need any of the things that it's strong against. 
but it is just like a solid Pokemon. Um, so it'll probably be worthwhile sticking with that one if, if, if we don't get anything else that actually has good type coverage for us. But hopefully we'll catch this Ariados as well. It's, this one's not likely to get used. We've already got Poison and Bug, and they're both stronger Pokemon. So anyway, eh, whatever. Eh, okay. Eh, okay. It's okay. We'll live with it, but that's cool. Great. So let's uh, let's see what else. Let's give it one more time. We'll check one in the uh, fishing, and then we'll, we'll see what's in the water when, we, when our repel falls off. All right. So what's this going to be? Anything good? Ariados. Okay. All right, we'll try it again. We'll just try it again, just because we are... Uh, I'm always inquisitive. Okay, I was so slow then. I thought I was going to miss that one. Okay, Ariados is... Okay, I, I don't care. I really don't care. It's all Ariados. We were going to get an Ariados, basically. That's what that, that's what that's telling me, is we were going to get an Ariados. Uh, okay, so this side doesn't fight you. Hello, just... Oh, my God. I, I hate that about this game. Cameron, the fuck photographer can fuck my nuts, dude. Okay, that's not what I meant to do. I'm probably gonna avoid trainers again, if I can, even though I didn't really try to avoid that one there. Uh, there's nothing over here. These islands, no, nothing. I remember where I got the EXP share on that first water route. That was impressive. I was happy with that. Uh, Scyther, we should be good. Uh, Flame Wheel really won't do more damage than than um, Surf at this point in time, so we'll just yeah, that did a bit of damage. Scythers are pretty powerful, but we're all good. EXP grind, level 3, level 4, level 5, level 6, level 7, level 8. Oh, only level 8. That wasn't that good. Uh, yeah, we'll use a flame wheel. Save our PP. That's cool. Level 9, level 10. That's cool. I don't mind that. It's pretty fun. Uh, we will also... We'll just heal up as well. <laughs> it's going to be fun. I suppose... It's probably not going to level up that much more after that one. If we fight like a Blissey and it gets half the XP from a Blissey, it might level up dramatically again. But no, that, that first episode where I got that EXP share, where I accidentally just double click an item location, that was dope. Uh, that was a very profitable water route. Uh, all right, so we'll, we'll see what's in the water just for shits and gigs. Blastoise, well, we know we don't need another one of those. <laughs> Had so many of them, although we lost one. We lost probably the best one. Uh, Kadabra, we've had you. So all duplications now. We had, obviously there's going to be quite a few duplications at this point in time. Kadabra, great. Well, not really that great. Cinnabar Island. Okay, so this is an encounter here. Just turn to Cinnabar. So once again, getting lots of encounters this episode. We will use our fishing rod and hopefully catch something. All right, let's see. Landed a Pokemon. All right. Good something, bad something, medium something. Oh, Mister. Okay, that's not too bad. Uh, won't be used, obviously, because it is... Because it's uh, water and rock. And unless... Unless Suicune or uh, Tyranitar die at this point, we'll be using those two instead of uh, Omastar. So... Yeah, actually, be interested to know if Omastar or Kabutops is better, because I've never really used either one. But, uh, you're, you're a, you're, you're, a, you're a star, you're a star, cool. What a name, you're a star. I used the wrong your, by the way, uh, just so you know. Um, that I can't spell, that I'm an idiot. I suppose the other your wouldn't have actually fit, but uh, that's all G. So, I'm pretty sure that there's... I'm probably going to swap... Do uh, what do we got? Ursa Ring. We'll swap him out for uh, Nido King. Hey, we're nearly on box three. There we go. That's exciting. Uh, where are you, Nido King? I'll move you in because the gym is at least sort of close by. I'm pret't sure it's uh, whatever that island is called where you get Articuno. Um, it's not the Whirl Islands, it's the other one, but I'm pretty sure there's like really nothing on Cinnabar Island now. Isn't that correct? There's just like uh, this dude, whoever the fuck this is. Who are you? My name's Blue. I was one oh, he goes back to Viridian. okay. Though it's short-lived thanks to Red. Anyway, take a good look around you. 
Yes, what do you have for me, Blue? A volcano erupts, and just like that, a whole town disappears. We can go on winning and losing in Pokemon, but if nature so much as twitches, we can be overwhelmed. In a second. That's the way it is. But anyway, I'm still a trainer. If I see a strong opponent, it makes me want to battle. If you want to battle me for real, show me how many counter bidge batches you've got. That's how they, that's the word there. Six, you're not ready to battle me. Yeah, so I gotta go to friggin' uh old mate over here. The Seafoam Islands, that's the one. And do that gym. So that's an exciting turn of events. Uh, we can see what we would have caught. Route 20. Okay, so another route. We're just piling up bloody encounters today. So let's see what we're going to get here. I'm hoping. I'm hoping for something just blow me away. I want another good sixth Pokemon. Even though all the Pokemon I've caught lately have actually been pretty good. Cyndaquil. Okay. So we can evolve this little dude as well. Uh, we probably... I wonder if a flame wheel will kill it. I think we can just catch this. Even though starters can be a bit of a pain to catch. I think we can probably just catch this. We have caught like nearly every single starter from the first two generations. We haven't caught a war turtle. Do we catch a squirtle? I'm not sure if we caught a squirtle. We haven't had a chummy. Okay, so we have... I'm not going to go through all of them. I don't know why I was planning on doing that. It's a really dumb idea. Okay. This thing's actually giving me some... This is being annoying. Actual annoying. Uh, the burn is the thing that's doing the most damage to us, though. So we're going to get rid of that. Uh, where are you? Burn heal. Burn heal. Alright, I think what I'm going to do is I am going to actually lemonade... And we can definitely look. We can definitely flame wheel this. Even a crit wouldn't kill us. Wouldn't kill it. I don't think. And for actually, funny is using rollout because that's actually starting to do a decent amount of damage to us. <laughs> How much is that going to do? Okay, we're still good, but I will heal because a crit rollout actually will do a lot of damage now because it's up to like the fourth or fifth one. How much is that going to do? Okay, sixty. I don't know if that was four or five. So we definitely will. Just one more heal. Okay, that was the last one. That's good. It did a decent amount of damage, didn't it? Okay, so this should... Oh, the burn again, the burn. All right, we're going to heal the burn because I'm sick of... It's just going to do more damage than we really want to take. All right, let's go. Swift. Okay, that's cool. It's not going to do enough damage to us unless it gets to like a large rollout number. So we can probably use... Let's use a Great Ball. Let's see how that goes. Get this Cyndaquil. No. Okay. Apparently it doesn't want to get caught. This has been a real douche about it. So if this evolves into something nice, it'll be very usable as well. So let's go. Finally. There we go. All right. I don't know what I want to call I'll be back in a sec with the name. All right. It's Flamorat. No, it's Flame Rat, because it's kind of like a flaming rat. I don't know. I don't actually know what it's meant to be. Someone tell me what the fuck is the Cyndaquil's meant to be, but call it a Flame Rat, because why the hell not? Okay, Super Rod, baby. Let's see what is... Okay, that was terrible. No, I don't want to use my bike in the water. <laughs> All right, so we're going to see what else we could have caught. I'm kind of happy with that one. That one will evolve again, obviously, so... All right, let's see. Let's see what you're going to be, baby. Cyndaquil, okay. So it might just not just be Cyndaquils around here. But we'll see. Uh, let's go, babe. Oh, God. I, that one actually came in real quick. I was not expecting it to, to catch something real quick, and I just completely flubbed it. Oh, I, need, I think I went too early then. That was lucky as well. Okay, Cyndaquil. There's got to be more than one thing on these roots. Like, I don't really understand what's going on here. Um, they're just, like, way more... Uh, what am I looking for? Way, way more catch. Oh, fuck, ghastly. Okay, we've had that. All right, so dupes all round now. Um, well, the, the Cyndaquil wasn't a dupe, but um, okay, trainer. I don't know why I ran straight into that person. Whatever. Um, ah, you little bitch! <laughs> How dare you? How absolutely dare you? Um, charge, great. All right, so we'll just earth power this thing. It should be dead. I don't think it's going to live it. Okay, it did live it. It didn't do a lot of damage to us, though. Um, no, what the hell is the word I was trying to say? More common. That's what I was trying to say. The, the, I'm just getting, like, really common Pokemon. But, uh, Jesus, I don't know what the hell's wrong with me. Words are failing me at the moam. At the moam, bro. I don't know what mo. Well, I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. At the, uh, probably use English words next time, but... 
We are definitely just speeding the fuck through this trainer. Um, so I think it might be worthwhile because the see. Uh, okay. We can go this way. Where are the Seafoam Islands? They're like real close now, right? And we're probably not going to do the gym today. We've probably done like most of an episode for us. So uh, that'd be the Seafoam Islands there, hey. We probably, so we just got to knock off one more trainer and then I think we'll be there. I'm not 100% sure. A dunce pass. Okay, so I should really have healed my bloody... Uh, Sui Cuda, but I'm going to do it now just for sheets and geeks. Um, but we should be all right here. This should die in two hits. Cool. Done, sparse. What a pointless situation to be in. Uh, forget a move. Who's learning something? Rock slide. Ooh, that's actually... He has pretty solid moves to start with. Sandstorm, bite, and now rock slide. Like, that's... That's pretty good, Tyranitar. I'm not gonna lie. I'm pretty happy with that. Okay, so here we go. So the gym is in here, I believe. Dratney! That would have been interesting. Oh, no, we've already caught it. The Pokeball's there. I don't know, I was getting all excited. It's like, it's actually just a... Uh, are you in a hurry? Hurry, how about a quick battle break? Um, It's just a... Uh, uh, electric again. Come on, man. Uh, yeah, uh, that's not going to do that much damage to us, is it? No, that'll do a little bit. Okay, never mind. I don't know why I thought that would do much damage. It's not, a, it's not that strong of a move. I could have killed it with either of these moves, couldn't I? There we go. Um... Yeah, no, we've already had a Dratini, so I don't know why I'm getting all hyped up about it and shit. It's not really worthwhile. Why did I put that per- Okay, I was like, why did I put them in front of the Seafoam Islands? But it's actually not in front of the Seafoam Islands. It's, uh... It's just, um... What the fuck am I trying to- I am so struggling for words today. I don't know what the hell's wrong with me. He's standing to an extra pace in front of it. Jesus, titty, titty, ballsack, Christ, what is wrong with me? Anyway! On that friggin' note, we're in the Seafoam Islands. There's a gym in here somewhere. Uh, Seafoam Islands. I'm not sure if you can get an encounter, but we'll save that for the next episode. So, I will see you then. It has been lovely to have you guys here. I appreciate you. I fucking appreciate the shit out of you. You people are the greatest. Uh, and I'll, I'll see you in the next episode. Thank you very much for watching. Bye, guys.